welcome to my channel. Whew, I'm very emotional right now, you guys. Um, but I had to go to Target. Number one, it hit 90% off, and I needed to get out of my house and go do something. So I asked my daughter if she wanted to go to Target because she somehow loves to go to Target. And we're trying to get her to go potty train. And like we're like, you can't go to Target unless you go potty on the potty, you know. So she just loves Target, but I heard that Target went 90% today, and I really wanted to go. I also heard Hobby Lobby went 90% off today, too, but um, I have two Targets in my area, and I wanted to hit both, but my daughter was getting, like, super tired, and she's like, can we go, Mom? And I said, yeah, so I only hit one Target, which was fine, and then I went to Hobby Lobby right next door, and, like, a lot of stuff was just all gone, and I didn't really need anything. I mostly, when I do 90% shopping, I try not to get, like... It depends on what it is, um, but I went super crazy at Target, and I'm here to share with you guys. Um, I do want to thank you guys for who all has watched my videos the last couple days. Um, we did put my cat down this morning. She um, actually had some kind of, there was something wrong with her, and they said she didn't have very much time to live. So I've cried so much today and all weekend long that I, I'm going to probably cry a little bit. But thank you guys for all the kind words. Um, about her, about me. I mean, I know a lot of you guys miss seeing her butt. Like, there's times where I'd be recording here and you'd just see a Paris butt. But she's now in a better place. She's not in pain anymore because she was doing really bad the last couple days. But thank you guys for being awesome. But I just had to get out of the house. I'm like, Graham, I have to go. I have to go shopping. I just want to forget it. Because if I sit at home, I would keep thinking about her, you know, right by my feet. Because she's always by my feet, especially when I craft. But, uh... She's in a better place now. That's all I'm going to say. She's in a better place. But let's just dig in and I can share with you guys what I got. So, I get to the store, right? And the first thing I always do is I go to the clothing section, especially like the baby clothes and all that stuff. Because when people go, when they go 90% shopping, they go straight towards the Christmas, which is fine. But I always go towards the clothes because half the time... They don't have those put to the side yet or any of that stuff. Some stores I've gone to, they've actually pulled all that stuff, but some stores they don't. And this store, they don't. So I always go to, straight to the clearance, uh, straight to the kids section. And I see this lady, this older lady, maybe about 75, and I, she had an entire cart filled with clothes. And I'm like, oh my gosh, she probably beat me to it. She probably, you know, grabbed everything. And I'm just like, man, well, then I go to the baby section and I see some like Santa pajamas and stuff. So I go and scan like one pair and I found a pair of pajamas, which I'll show you that in a second. And then here she comes and she's got her cart filled up and she, I says, I says, oh, are you shopping 90% off? She's like, yeah, these are great deals. And I says, well, I just scanned this and this is ringing up 90%, per nine, I got the hiccups, this is 90% off. And she's like, oh, really? So then Charlotte was with me. And, like, you know, she's just, you know, Charlotte's being a flirt that she always is. And this lady's like, oh, I wonder if this is. I said, I'll go check. I'll go check. So I kept running for the lady to go price check because I had some of the same stuff as her. And we found a bunch of stuff. And then she's like, oh, you need to go up to the front of the store right where you walk in. Like, right by the service desk, they had some seasonal stuff there. And I'm like, oh, okay. So I go there and they had, like, some of the the family pajamas that were all picked over. Like, it was either extra, 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 extra large or, like, super, or mostly, like, for, like, little babies. And I found some slippers and stuff. And then I, after that, then I went through the house goods section. And then I went to the back of the store. My my normal Christmas stuff was just all picked over. And I did get a couple things. And then I go back to the kids section. So I go to the little girls section and the boys section. Because for little girls now, Charlotte's almost at that age where I can start. Well, she, I buy stuff off season. I always buy stuff off season. So I go to the little girls section. And I look at their, like, table full of shirts. Well, they do have some Christmas themed shirts in there so I keep go price checking well as I grabbed them I go back to the price scanner and that lady is still there scanning prices I says oh are you still having fun she's like yes I'm getting so much stuff I'm gonna spend so much money and I'm just like man this lady I want this lady to be my friend I absolutely loved hanging out with her I mean we were together for a good maybe 20 minutes just picking out clothes and stuff and then she saw that I grabbed some bows and she's like oh where'd you get those and then we go to the girls section and then I, we go and price check that stuff but that lady was a who and I'm hope I like I'm just like her when I get her age because that lady made today so much fun so let's just stop talking and let's dig in with my haul you guys so I got these um multi 
purpose or this classic multi tool. It was a do, it was a dollar fifty on sale. So they had this for fifteen dollars, and they, my store had tons of them. They had like maybe thirty, forty left. So it is a like ten in one industrial tool. And I thought this would be kind of good for me to have for like with my crafting and stuff. So I take a picture and I send it to the husband. I'm like, I just send it to him. And he's like, how many can you get? I'm like, well, how many do you want? And he said three. So I, I bought, I went back and got a couple more. And then I sent a picture to my mom and my mom's like, oh, can you get me one? As I was checking out, she asked for she could get one. So I ran back and got some. But I ended up getting, I think, like seven of these um, for like $1.50. You can't go wrong. And I will definitely use them it's kind of a good tool to have inside your car because i always buy some stuff where i'm like crap i wish i had some scissors and there is a little knife in here a little knife and you know a little screwdriver a nail file so i don't even know what it says it says it's pliers a wire cutter an a wall a w l a bottle opener a flathead screwdriver a saw knife phillips head screwdriver and a flat screwdriver so pretty good for a dollar fifty i think i got seven of these so this bag has um one two three four five it has five right here so i got five of those multi-tools and then when i get to the other yep i got the other bag right here so i got another two more so that can't go wrong for a dollar fifty for a little multi-tool set well then i went to the little girl section and i found this little jojo siwa head bow or head yeah the hair bow and this was originally eight dollars and these were ringing up 80 cents um there was another one with candy canes on it and then there was one with snowflakes on it and the one with snowflakes did not ring up on sale but the candy cane one and the uh reindeer one ring up 80 cents so that lady was like oh i want to get a bunch of those so we got that then i found this dress over in the girls section just kind of just sitting all by itself this is a size 14 16 which if i can i if i wanted to i could fit into it i actually have a f size 14 16 sweatshirt that i wear um that i got at target and it's a little snug but i'm starting to lose weight but yeah this was 24 dollars, and i got it for two dollars and 40 cents we always have like an ugly sweater party every year and I thought this is kind of cute. Either I could wear it or I can wait till Charlotte gets a little bit bigger to wear it. But I thought that is cute for $2.40. You can't go wrong with that. Then, like I said, I was looking in the, I was looking like on the shelves and stuff. And they had this little shirt with like a little candy cane heart. So these were originally $8 and these were ringing up 80 cents. So 80 cents. And I kind of, I could have gotten like more sizes if I wanted to. Um, but Charlotte was just like, Mom, can we go? Because we're already there for an hour. But for 80 cents, you can't go wrong for shirts. And then even sometimes when you resell clothes, I always resell them for like a dollar. So I always make a profit when I sell stuff like that. So as you guys know, I have two nephews. Uh, one is three months old and another one is... 10 months old so i'm always buying stuff for people as you guys know i love helping people out even though they don't need help but i still love helping people out so i found these pair of pajamas this is a 2t um i was gonna give this to my nephew who is three months so he could wear this next year um because these pajamas i think are a little bit snug and um you know if they and who cares if it's christmas stuff but can't go wrong with this. This was originally $17, so I got a two-pack for $1.70. $1.70, which is awesome. Then I um, found these up at the front of the store in, like, little cardboard boxes, but these are little pajama nightgowns. Uh, these were originally $15, so I got this one for $1.50. Fifty. This is a size five, so Charlotte could probably wear that now if she wanted to. And then I found this nightgown also um it is a size six again 15 so i got this for a dollar 50. then i found this kind of just floating around and this is an 18 months so i thought maybe my one nephew could wear this again next possibly next year between the 2t but i find these pajamas run really tight um but these were 12 dollars. i got this for a dollar 20. and then i found this pair of pajamas um and this was a 2T, and this is $14, so I thought that is really, really cute. And then I got, uh, so that was $1.40.
Then I got these pajamas. These are like, it says it's a snug fit. So it's really, a, it's Burt's Bees is the brand. And these were $1.70. Uh, dollars, so this was a, a $17.95. So I paid $1.79 for this. So this is a 2T. And then I ended up getting also a 3T for my other nephew. So that was awesome. And then I found this Grinch pajamas, you guys. These are so soft it is so soft but this was originally twelve dollars so i got this for a dollar twenty and this was um this is a, a 18 months but i thought that is super super cute so i got that and then i will show you guys more in a second i ended up getting some slippers um i got these slippers were also 90 percent off i got these ones these were 25 dollars originally um, I got them for $2.50. I'm always like looking for slippers. Now these are, I think these are men's slippers. So they were a little bit big, but you know what? I don't care. When I'm walking around the house and my toes are cold, I got those. And so then I also got these women's slippers. Now these are the, uh, Deer Form brands, which are really cute. These were originally 20 bucks, so I got them for $2. This was a medium. It is a little snug. Um, my feet are a size 8.5, and, and these were 7, 8, but they did fit me pretty good. I tried them on, um, but I thought, I'm going to get some more slippers because I absolutely love, 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 love slippers. So, got those, and if my husband wants to wear the black ones, he can wear the black ones. So, I got those. Then I got, um, this was sitting in just the, the shelf with the boys' shirts and stuff. So I'm like, oh, it's got Santa stuff on it. So I was going to scan this. This was originally $8. I scanned it $0.80. Cents. $0.80 cents for this. And we usually have like an ugly sweater party like I mentioned. My son doesn't like wearing sweaters, but I thought he could always wear something like this, you know, to the party. So I thought that'd be kind of cute. Now last year I bought a bunch of the Peanuts sweatshirts and sweatpants for my ne my nephews and I bought some for Charlotte and she's got actually a sweatshirt of the Snoopy but um, my store only had these but these were an extra small so I thought she would grow into these so super cute awesome extra small small pants these were originally $15 so I got them for a dollar fifty these were up when you walked up in the, the store now she saw we saw this little mystery ornament. It was halfway opened when we saw it, but it didn't reveal what it was. I scanned it and it, it rang up 50 cents. Um, so last year at Walmart, I actually got some stuff for um, on sale and I ended up getting uh, Belle and Cinderella. Well, we opened it up and we got Belle again, which is fine because Belle is my favorite princess. So Charlotte was pretty excited. You know, she's like, ooh, and like, for 50 cents you can't go wrong with that i was eyeing this up right before christmas i wanted to get a bluey ornament and they had this for four dollars and 99 cents and i'm like no i'm not gonna get it i'm not gonna get it so as i was just kind of scrounging around in the back of the store i found this and i scanned it and it rang up 50 cents and i'm like we're gonna buy it we're gonna buy a bluey ornament and i think it's actually just a little figurine so 50 cents for a bluey figurine which is awesome this was in the girls section on the shelves and it just says peace and love this was eight dollars i got it for 80 cents so i was pretty excited for that they did have some other winter shirts but i scanned them and they were ringing up regular price i ended up getting some of these christmas vacation national lampoon's christmas vacation double crisp candy this is like you know and one thing i like about this this bag is like filled like they actually filled it it's named by palmer so you see a lot of the stuff around christmas time i don't know what the regular price was for these because i think the candy was still 70 percent off but 80 cents 80 cents so i grabbed two bags and there was a lady like eyeing them up and i went and scanned it and i said oh those are ringing up 80 cents she's like oh i guess i better get some so i got two bags of the chocolate double crisp candy which i was excited for that and I got one more bag to share with you guys on that. Like I said, I really needed this retail therapy. So I found these cute little pajamas. This is a 5T, so this will be what Charlotte can wear either now or next year. Um, but these were originally 16 bucks, and I got them for $1.60. I told the cashier she could keep that stuff on the hangers. I'm like, I don't care. It's easier for me to put it away. 
And then I got, this is the first thing I actually grabbed was these pajamas. So this is a two pack of footed pajamas. So two pack footed pajamas in a 5T. This was originally $18 and this was $1.80. So I thought super cute pajamas to get for Charlotte for $1.80. And that was my haul, you guys. My total, I came to $46.50. Um, but then I got $2.33 off for tax or for the red card, but then I also got um, $2.43 charged for taxes. But I did buy. Um, Nickelodeon. I did buy Pokemon pack of cards, so that was four dollars and forty nine cents. And then I bought three uh, gummies. So if you take seven dollars off, I paid like forty bucks for all this stuff. Forty dollars for all that stuff, and everything rang up regular price, which was super super awesome. So I am happy. Oh, the candy was ninety eight cents. Ninety eight cents. I don't know why I said eighty cents, but ninety eight cents for that great great deal i am happy with what i got and a much needed so if you guys are going to go shopping i definitely go shopping now um they may or may not have it available tomorrow last year i went and they were taking it out of the system as i was getting them in my cart and they actually overrode everything to 90 percent off because some of the stuff wasn't fully deleted like they had one of those big pallets and they were just throwing them in the pallet so definitely get that stuff while you can i want to give you guys let me know by giving this video a great big thumbs up thank you guys for being a subscriber thank you guys for being supportive thank you guys for all the kind words about my my child my first child and i will see you guys next year i hope you guys all had a new happy new year and i will see you guys for next haul um hopefully well hopefully walmart's got some 90 percent coming up soon i know it's 75 percent off but hopefully we can get some 90 percent off savings at walmart thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time see you later Bye bye